तो आई फ्रेंड दिस इज अमित एंड यू आर वॉच माय चैनल इंफॉर्मेशन एंड एजुकेशन वीडियो हियर इज द इंपॉर्टेंट अपडेट रिगार्डिंग द 6th राउंड ऑफ जोसा काउंसलिंग एज यू वी आर गेटिंग द रिजल्ट एट 5 पीएम इन अर्लीयर राउंड बट नाउ टुडे दैट इज द 6th राउंड अलॉटमेंट विल बी डन एट 8 पीएम यू कैन चेक द ऑफिशियल शेड्यूल रिगार्डिंग दैट आल्सो आई विल ट्राई टू शो यू लाइव हियर आल्सो दैट इज द शेड्यूल फॉर राउंड 6 इज एट 8 पीएम टुडे अनलाइक ऑफ अर्लीयर राउंड दैट इज 5 पीएम टुडे यू विल बी गेटिंग द रिजल्ट एट 8 पीएम so now the important question for those student who will get the seat for the first time obviously you need to do the formality that is only two thing not the third thing because willingness there will be only free jobs and nothing else and all those student who have got the seat multiple times then also you don't need to do anything because now your uh, now your willingness will be automatically changed to freeze you don't need to do any type of manual freeze it will be automatically freeze so the important update for those student who will get the seat for the first time you need to pay the seat acceptance fee as well as the pa that is partial admission fee from 19 to 21 and these are the detail that i am talking for nits if you will get the seat for the first time in iits then obviously you need to pay the seat acceptance fee and after that for iits please try to listen my word all those student who have got the iits i think you will be required to pay the fee at the college only that is after deducting your seat acceptance fee whatever you pay that is 3000 they will take as a jusa processing fee and remaining amount will be adjusted with your first year academic fee and remaining whatever will be you have to pay at the time of admission but for an it plus system that is an it triple it gpi you need to pay the pf that is clearly mentioned here you can check that is on schedule round 6 schedule that is around 8 pm you will be getting the result and after that up to 16th of october you will able to do the online reporting if you will get the seat for the first time as i have discussed and the uh, if you will have any type of query in the document whatever you will upload that also need to be respond up to 8 pm 17th of october that is very less time you are getting please don't do any type of mistake there otherwise your seat will be cancel and no one can provide you the seat again now if you talk about here it is strictly mentioned for an it plus system only means no iits so withdrawal can be done after that also that is from 17 to 18th of october you can do the withdrawal if you don't want to take admission you will get the refund but obviously if you will not do that then also you will get the refund if you will not pay the paf once you pay the paf and you will not join the csap counseling you will not get any type of refund because there will be no withdrawal option after that so if you want to get the refund either you do the withdraw other otherwise you can up for not paying the pf in the in both the cases you will be getting the refund so now if you talk about the csab eligibility that is in csab what type of uh, what type of a student will be eligible so i would like to inform you all type of student will be eligible until unless your document has been rejected means uh, you you are not having the updated document now if you are having the updated document that is whatever you have got the rejection in previous and now you have made other one then you can surely do the csab counseling that will be Uh, starting from 26 that is on 25 you will be having the complete list of vacancy what are available after josa counseling I, i will be guiding you completely for complete process of csab counseling because there are lots of risk involved you may lose your previous seat you may get the less deserving seat you may have to uh, regret for your money or you may have to regret for next year as well so important thing is that you need to do it very carefully if you need, if you know everything you can do by yourself otherwise i am here to guide you there is a nominal charge for that try to contact me through instagram or whatsapp number if required so thanks for watching this video once again i would like to inform you that allotment of today will be done at 8 pm instead of 5 pm so thanks again for watching this video please try to subscribe So now I would like to introduce the Philo app, where you can get the solution of all your question, doubt, or you have problem with any type of concept related to JEE or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is, first you have to download the Philo app in the Play Store, and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number. And after that, take the photo of your question and upload that in the app. And after that, within 60 second, you will be connected to the India's best educator. Okay, question. Me, you want to know that the bulb's power is how much? If the bulb is what? वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220। तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहाँ पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो एप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड आई ई बी डबल जीरो वन यू विल गेट द टेन इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट